Kevin Durant has announced his decision to retire his number 35 jersey. What he'll be wearing on his back with the Nets is coming up. It's a number he hinted at a while back in April. It seems like he knew this switch was coming, and it seems like the league knew that KD and Kyrie were going to the Nets since February. The two apparently made a pact months ago, and everyone was aware of it. Hey everyone, it's Devin Howard. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at Devin Howard to stay up to date with me, and subscribe to the Fumble so you never miss the latest news about your favorite teams and athletes. Now let's talk all things KD. Kevin Durant will no longer be sporting the number 35 in his upcoming games on the Brooklyn Nets. The all-star player announced his number change in a lengthy Instagram post where he says that for the first time in his professional career, he'll wear the number 7. In another post on his 35 Ventures Instagram page, he listed all the places 35 has taken him, including to the Warriors, allowing him to win, quote, two championships and form brotherhoods no time or distance will ever break. But he feels that his time as number 35 is over, he wrote, As I start this new chapter in my basketball life, the number I'll be wearing on my back is the number 7 next time you see me on the floor. One time Brooklyn. So it sounds like KD just wanted to commemorate his big career move by changing up his number, but it's still a little strange. I mean, his old number inspired the name of his company, 35 Ventures, and it's the number he's been associated with since 2007. Is there something more to this move? Currently, it doesn't seem like it, but it is something he seems to have been thinking about for a long while now. It doesn't seem like it was a spur of the moment thing for the all-star player. Back in April, the athlete attended a press conference wearing a hat with the number seven on it, which is causing fans to wonder if he was hinting at his number change way back then. The hat is part of a collection called the Compound Seven Snapback. Raptors point guard Kyle Lowry wore a similar hat during the playoffs, but he also wears jersey number seven, so it makes more sense. Perhaps KD was gearing up to sport his own jersey number seven by wearing a hat to match. If KD was thinking about this switch for a while, it would make sense considering his decision to leave the Warriors for the Nets has reportedly been common knowledge among other players for months now. Basically, we were the only ones who didn't see this Nets move coming. Bobby Portis said that KD and Kyrie's plans were the worst kept secret in the NBA. He said, I knew what was going to happen in February. He added, everybody knew that. I just don't think the media knew that. Us basketball players, we all knew that. It's funny because looking back, we all felt pretty certain that these two would end up in New York, but with the Knicks, not the Nets. So we sensed a move, we were just off by a bit. Apparently in the league, everyone knew for sure that it was going to happen. There were rumors throughout the season that the two star players had some sort of pact, which was supported by that video of the two of them talking passionately in the hallway at the All-Star game. That followed the Porzingis trade that left the Knicks with enough cap space for two max contracts. The speculation grew even stronger while the Warriors fought for a three-peat, and KD came forward and tried to shut down all the chatter. He said, I have nothing to do with the Knicks. I don't know who traded Porzingis. They've got nothing to do with me. I'm trying to play basketball. Y'all come in here every day and ask me about free agency. Ask my teammates, my coaches, rile up the fans about it. Let us play basketball, that's all I'm saying. So it turns out he was telling the truth, at least about not having anything to do with the Knicks because he allegedly knew all along he was going to New York to the Nets. Lots of changes happening with KD. He'll be sitting out his first year with the Nets to recover from his injury, but once he's back up playing, he'll be on the court repping that number seven. Why do you all think he ditched the number 35? Does anyone else think it's a little strange? Let me know in the comments. Make sure you subscribe and tune in later for more sports news. I'm Devin Howard. See you later.